All right, it's morning on the Hill, and we're talking local politics. Our guest today is mayoral candidate Karen Rowe. Hello, Karen, and thanks for being here. Tell us about yourself. Sure. Um, I was born and raised in Tree Hill, where I have two local businesses. Uh, I went to school at Tree Hill High, and I have a son who's about to graduate from there as well. Well, great. Now, tell our voters why they should vote for you over your opponent, Dan Scott. Because... This town and the people here matter to me. You know, I find that some people care more about being a leader than they do about the people they're leading. And I'm a big fan of the Tree Hill Ravens. Go Ravens! <laughs> Woot! All right, let's take some calls. Our first caller is Keith. He's a unemployed mechanic from Tree Hill. Keith, hello, and you're on the air. Uh, yes, I have a question for Mrs. Rowe. I'm sorry, I meant Miss Rowe. That's right, you're not married. What do you think about the fact that your business partner is supporting your opponent? Yes, uh, that is true. Ironically, my business partner is married to my opponent, so I will have to forgive her her misplaced vote and her lack of taste. Luckily, she has a better head for business than she does for relationships. <laughs> Speaking of relationships, didn't you have a child out of wedlock? Right. Well, I like to think of it as a single parent who is raising her child to be a responsible man, unlike the boy who fathered him. Well said. All right, let's move on. What are you, eight years old? Oh, right. This coming from a woman who cut the ass out of all my pants. Too bad the one in my life won't go away. Good one, Deb. But before you start getting all high and mighty, or in your case, just high... Maybe you should think about the deal we made. You're supposed to be supporting me in public. You wouldn't want me going against our little bargain, would you? What could you possibly do to me that you haven't already done? Who said anything about you? Hey. Just wanted to see how the star player was doing the day before his first game. Like a rock, had a boy. Well, Bear Creek is weak this year. A lot of scouts will be there, though. How's a knee? Like a rock. Good. Anything else bugging you? Just you. Should have seen that one coming. Yeah. This doesn't feel like we're getting out, Mom. Feels more like we're staying. 